Han Meditations. Over 300 meditations. You are here for a reason. Subscribe and see what happens next. The Emerald Tablets, Tablet 8, The Key of Mystery. Unto thee, O man, have I given my knowledge. Unto thee have I given of light. Hear ye now, and receive my wisdom, brought from space planes above and beyond. Not as man am I, for free have I become of dimensions and planes, in each take I on a new body, in each I change in my form. Know I now that the formless is all there is of form. Great is the wisdom of the seven. Mighty are they from beyond, manifest they through their power, filled by force from beyond. Hear ye these words of wisdom, hear ye and make them thine own. Find in them the formless, Mystery is but hidden knowledge. Know and ye shall unveil. Find the deep buried wisdom and be master of darkness and light. Deep are the mysteries around thee, hidden the secrets of old. Search through the keys of my wisdom. Surely shall ye find the way. The gateway of power is secret, but he who attains shall receive. Look to the light, O my brother. Open and ye shall receive. Press on through the valley of darkness, overcome the dweller of night. Keep ever thine eyes of the light plain, and thou shalt be one with the light. Man is in process of changing to forms that are not of this world. Grows he is time to the formless, a plain on the cycle above. Know ye, ye must become formless before ye are with the light. List ye, O man, to my voice, telling of pathways to light, showing the way of attainment, when ye shall be one with the light. Search ye the mysteries of earth's heart, learn the law that exists, holding the stars in their balance by the force of the primordial mist. Seek ye the flame of earth's life, bathe in the galler of its flame. Follow the three-cornered pathway until thou too art a flame. Speak thou in words without voice to those who dwell down below. Enter the blue litten temple and bathe in the fire of all life. Know, O oh man, thou art complex, a being of earth and of fire. Let thy flame shine out brightly. Be thou only the fire. Wisdom is hidden in darkness when lit by the flame of the soul. Find thou the wisdom and be light born, a son of the light without form. Seek thee ever more wisdom, find it in the heart of the flame. Know that only by striving and light pour into thy brain. Now have I spoken with wisdom. List to my voice and obey. Tear open the veils of the darkness. Shine a light on the way. Speak I of ancient Atlantis, speak of the days of the kingdom of shadows, speak of the coming of the children of shadows. Out of the great deep were they called by the wisdom of earth men, called for the purpose of gaining great power. Far in the past, before Atlantis existed, men there were who delved into darkness, using dark magic, calling up beings from the great deep below us. Forth came they into this cycle, formless were they of another vibration, existing unseen by the children of earth men. Only through blood could they have formed being, only through man could they live in the world. In ages past were they conquered by masters, driven below to the place whence they came. But some there were who remained, hidden in spaces and plains unknown to man live they in Atlantis as shadows. But at times they appeared among men, I, when the blood was offered, for they came, they to dwell among men. In the form of man they amongst us, but only to sight were they as our men, 
serpent-headed, when the glamour was lifted, but appearing to man, as men among men. Crept they into the councils, taking forms that were like unto men, slaying by their arts the chiefs of the kingdoms, taking their form and ruling o'er man. Only by magic could they be discovered, only by sound could their faces be seen. Sought they from the kingdom of shadows to destroy man and rule in his place. But know ye, the masters were mighty in magic, able to lift the veal from the face of the serpent, able to send him back to his place, came they to man and taught him the secret, the word that only a man can pronounce. Swift then they lifted the veal from the serpent and cast him forth from the place among men. Yet beware, the serpent still liveth in a place that is open at times to the world. Unseen they walk among thee, in places where the rites have been said. Again as time passes onward, shall they take the semblance of men. Called may they be by the master, who knows the white or the black, but only the white master may control and bind them while in the flesh. Seek not the kingdom of shadows, for evil will surely appear. For only the master of brightness shall conquer the shadow of fear. Know ye, O my brother, that fear is an obstacle great. Be master of all in the brightness, the shadow will soon disappear. Hear ye and heed my wisdom, the voice of light is clear. Seek not the valley of shadow, and light will only appear. List ye, O man, to the depth of my wisdom. Speak I of knowledge hidden from man. Far have I been on my journey through space-time, even to the end of space of this cycle. I glimpsed the hound of the barrier, lying in wait for he who would pass them. In that space where time exists not, faintly I sense the guardians of cycles. Move they only through angles. Free are they not of the curved dimensions. Strange and terrible are the hounds of the barrier. Follow the consciousness to the limits of space. Think not to escape by entering your body, for follow they fast the soul through angles. Only the circle will give ye protection, save from the claws of the dwellers in angles. Once in a time past, I approached the great barrier, and saw on the shores where time exists not, the formless forms of the hounds of the barrier. I hiding in the mist beyond time I found them, and they scented me afar off, raised themselves and gave the great bell cry that could only be heard from cycle to cycle, and moved through space toward my soul. Fled I then fast before them, back from time's unthinkable end. But ever after me pursued they, moving in strange angles not known to man, I on the gray shores of time-space's end found I the hounds of the barrier, ravening for the soul who attempts the beyond. Fled I through circles back to my body, fled and fast after me they followed. I after me the devourers followed, seeking through angles to devour my soul. I know ye man, that the soul who dares the barrier may be held in bondage by the hounds from beyond time, held till this cycle is completed and left behind when the consciousness leaves. Entered I my body, created the cycles that know not angles, created the form that from my form was formed, made my body into a circle, and lost the pursuers in the circles of time. But even yet, when free from my body, cautious ever must I be not to move through angles, else my soul may never be free. Know ye the hounds of the barrier move only through angles, and never through curves of space. Only by moving through curves can ye escape them, for in angles they will pursue thee, O man, Heed ye my warning, seek not to break open the gate to beyond. Few there are who have succeeded in passing the barrier to the greater light that shines beyond. For know ye 
ever the dwellers seek such souls to hold in their thrall. Listen, O man, and heed ye my warning. Seek ye to move not in angles but curves, and if while free from thy body, you hearest the sound, like the bay of a hound, ringing clear and bell-like through thy being, flee back to thy body through circles, penetrate not the midst mist before. When thou hast entered the form thou hast dwelt in, Use thou the cross and the circle combined. Open thy mouth and use thou thy voice. Utter the word and thou shalt be free. Only the one who of light has the fullest can hope to pass by the guards of the way. And then must he move through strange curves and angles that are formed in direction not known to man. List ye, O man, and heed ye my warning. Attempt not to pass the guards on the way. Rather should ye seek to gain of thine own light and make thyself ready to pass on the way. Light is thine ultimate end, O my brother. Seek and find ever the light on the way. Tablet 8. The Key of Mystery. Completed.